Hi, my name is Emmy Barron. I have been attending Redeemer for 11 years now, um, and I've been involved in the kids' ministry, the student ministry, and in the worship team. When I first heard about the Worth It initiative, uh, I kind of tuned it out. Sorry, Dusty. Um, <laughs> I thought that because I was a high school student and not making money all year round that I did not need to give the money that I was making in the summers um, to the church. Just, I thought I was exempted. I went to advanced commitment night with my family, um, and while we were there, we were asked to write down what we felt God was calling us to do on a little wooden block. Um, and just during that night, I thought, um, I felt really called to write down that the word surrender, um, that God was calling me to surrender to Him. Um, and how can one surrender everything to a God and yet not that not include money? God is a faithful God. Uh, Lamentations 3, 22 and 23 says that His mercies are new every morning, and I have just found that to be so true. He fills us up with what is better than what we've given to Him. He fills us up with Himself. Um, he doesn't leave us or forsake us, and um, I have seen that really evidently during this season, um, which has been very uncertain for so many people. Uh, but He is a God that takes what we give um, and uses it for His glory and for our good. Worth It for me as a high school student has uh, looked like giving monthly, um, and it's not m as much as maybe my parents give, um, but it's a big commitment for me. and. Um, one of the really important things that I had to realize was that he wasn't, God wasn't asking for anything more than that. Um, he wants us to give what we have and give it generously.